Toronto. No shortage of history, a tremendous environment to watch hockey, and the Maple Leafs are on home ice. We are just seconds away now from puck drop. The Leafs start things off on the right note by winning the opening draw. Moves it to the middle! Aho's third eye zone ability is his incredible passing skills and his knack for completing difficult plays to set up his teammates. Marner's got that third eye zone ability, which means he's fantastic at making those difficult passes to create the perfect chance for his teammates. I'm expecting one of these star players to push their team tonight. James, over to you. And a stick break set up. The Leafs pick up steam and are on the attack. Oh, and he whiffs on it. Goaltender covers it up and we'll get a reset here. Matthews is an example of how skilled players can score highlight real goals, guys. He's known for deking his way to the blue paint, then rippling the twine with a quick shot, and that's his shot. Scores! And a little home cooking pays off as they get on the board quickly here. Gotta love the home cooking, James, as this team really fires up the crowd with that start and sending a clear message they want this game. Well, this is a play it looks like they worked on practice. He gets the win, and then the quick-release shot buries it home. The Leafs and their fans are buzzing right now. How about that? A quick strike just minutes into this one. Well, that quick strike gets them on their feet. And listen, when you're playing, you can feel that energy. You feed off it when your home crowd is cheering for you, especially when you're playing well. No better way than getting on the board first. And the puck stopper hangs on to get a breather here for the team. Slavin's able to defend one-on-one -on -one situations so well because he keeps his cool, reads the play, and stays with his opponent, guys. That's his shutdown zone ability, and it's how he can contain the opposition. Moose to Brody. Up to the challenge as he gets his pad on it. ton of energy for your team. The rebound pops out after the shot. You have to have the hard stick be heavy on it with it on the ice, battling the beat for it. He does it and he buries it. Still plenty of time left in this frame. Toronto's been the better team here over the last few minutes, increasing their lead to two. The Leafs get a hold of the puck off the draw. Here's a shot! when he scores his goal, James. Why? Because he's tenacious on the play. He doesn't just shoot the puck. He finds his own rebound, and then he puts it in. That's a great play. Well, they don't ask how it goes in, James, just if it goes in. But this is one of those goals that's all about the effort areas, the hard work, and the timing to get to the rebound first. Toronto's offense has been on fire to start this one, and still lots of time left in the first. Carolinas won the draw in the neutral zone. Good hit to pop him off the puck. Quick feed to Ajo. Gets a piece of it to keep it out. And the puck's booted away. Picked up along the boards by Carolina. And loves a shot. He was totally locked in on that play. Carolina's got a hold of the puck now. My goodness, look at this. The pressure is really starting to cook. And the defensive team's got it now! The Leafs have done everything right tonight. The habits, the chip length, everything, James, and it's shown on the scoreboard. Takes the shot. Just slide to the net. Picked up along the wall by Domi. With the stop. Here's a short pass to Drury. Toronto's got a hold of it along the wall. Sends a pass over.
the halfway mark of this period. Toronto's turned this into a blowout, now leading by four. The Hurricanes get a hold of the draw. Nice stick work to knock the puck loose. From the right side, takes the pass. Pass back to the point. Carolina's got the puck inside the defensive zone. And that's broken up by Domi. Moves it quickly over to McCabe. Toronto's got the puck here in the open ice. Broken up with the stick in the defensive end. In front of the net, the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. The Leafs have a big lead already here as we near the end of period number one. They have certainly come to shine tonight. Toronto's going to start with the puck inside the offensive zone. Makes the save! Passes it in front, and that's intercepted. And we get a whistle as the goaltender decides to hang on to this one. Toronto's put a lot of pucks on net, and they continue to lead late in the first. Carolina's got it in the defensive zone. Working the puck deep inside their own end. Inside the offensive zone. Carolina's playing it from the side. Quick pass to Marner. Matthews carries the puck in his own zone. Gaining steam here on the attack. Winding down the final minute of this opening frame. Nosen's got it against the boards. And that's a great heads up play by Giordano. Toronto's been stifling their opponent all game long. Just they're right up in their face. They're turning over pucks. They're finding ways to interrupt the play. And wow, they're going forward quick and in a hurry. And they're just dominating the scoreboard. All right, time to get a clean sheet of ice here as period number one comes to an end. As you heard the horn sound, we'll be back with much, much more as this is going to be a fun one. Both teams with a chance to recharge and refresh in this second period about set to get underway. It was quite the one-sided tilt in the first 20 minutes. Let's see if that continues here in the second. Well, Cheryl, we got 20 minutes under our belts in this one. How do you sum up the performance? Toronto's playing fast and intense, and in terms of puck pursuit, man, they have dominated. They've been first on it. And when they haven't, guess what? They close so quickly that they force their opponent into vulnerable spots. Can't keep a hold of it as he's jostled off the puck. The Hurricanes have it now. Takes the feed from the left side. Comes over the big scores! Well, the goaltender's gonna wanna have that one back. He put it in himself. Well, the position is tough enough, and then you have these goals that wind up in the back of the net. He deposited it himself, and that's a real tough one to handle. This next shift, this next save, it's huge. Carolina's been on their heels all night long, but they finally pushed back here in period number two. Certainly something positive to get on the board, but they're going to have to build on top of it if they want to really create some momentum and believe that they're back in this game. Shot! Toronto's got the puck in the defensive end. Look at this down the right wing. They're on the attack. Tries to feed it over to Natchez. Burns works the puck in his own zone. Throws it in. Takes a spill onto the ice and loses the puck. Riley's stick handling in his own zone. Off the left wing and into center. Carolina's gained possession along the boards. Moves it to Burns. Nice zone entry from the left. Shot! Stopped with ease. Samsonov's done a good job making that save, especially because it's been a quiet night for him. It's been an offensive explosion in the other end, but when you're faced with a save, you have to make it. You don't want to open the door for your opponent. Carolina's got it in the offensive zone. Quick feed to Stahl. And he makes the easy save. Denies him again. He makes some consecutive saves there. He's got to be wondering where his defense are. I mean, how about a little help? Sends it in front. Great defensive play to pick off the pass. Oh, excellent use of the stick as he knocks that one away. We'll get a face off after the puck stays covered up. Stahl's the leader of this team, James. He knows exactly what to do. He has been in these situations before. He's got to put this team on his back with this offensive zone face off and lead the charge. 
poked away in the offensive end. The Leafs will play it in their own end. And he takes the dish. Broken up with the stick in the defensive zone. Angles it over to Martinick. Here's a pass to the middle. And he denies that great opportunity there. Now a quick pass to Robertson. And he takes the feed. Quick shot. Stones him in front. Sometimes goaltenders just make it look easy, James. And look at how big he makes himself in the net as he's trying to track and find the puck at all costs. It almost looks easy for him, but that's an impressive save. Toronto's dominated right from the start. Their offense clicking on all cylinders, and they lead here in the second. Receives the pass. Quick stop by Samsonov. Takes a shot. Oh, what a glove save there. He read that perfectly. Loose puck battle along the boards. And he slides it quickly. Scores! A huge goal here has put them right back into this one. Yeah, and if they can get one more, they'll be one away from tying this game up, James. So it's about building and continually finding ways to press and be aggressive on the puck. To me, these are the types of plays that should show up in the video room at practice tomorrow, James. I mean, it's about having heart and being tenacious on the puck. The never-quit attitude leads to the assist that it leads to the eventual goal. Carolina suddenly made a lot of people sit up here in these stands as they've made it a two-goal game now. Well, it's a game now, and everyone's standing because they know they're back in it. Just a two-goal deficit. One more, and they're within striking distance. Made the stop on the play. And he's pulled over to the ice and loses the puck. Takes it at center. Second intermission approaching quickly here. Takes the feed. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Centering feed. Can't take the play. And there's the horn bringing the second period to an end. All right, they say three is the magic number. Period number three is coming up next. Hey, hockey fans, follow the team all season long on the radio. Welcome back to EA Sports. The final frame looms here as the officials set to drop the puck on period number three. And they have dropped the puck here on the final frame. Well, with two periods played, Pounder, your thoughts? Toronto's leading in this high-scoring, high-flying game, but I gotta tell you, the goaltenders on both sides, they must absolutely hate it. It's a 200-foot game of odd man rushes and back-and-forth play. The Hurricanes have it against the wall. From the right wing, he moves it to the middle. Gets a piece of it with the glove. The Leafs will play it from the defensive zone. Toronto's got the puck along the wall. Still has possession. Oh, a clutch save! Matthews isn't taking no for an answer, James. I mean, he's falling. He's got the puck on his stick, and he's saying, I'm directing it to the net no matter what it takes. That's a great opportunity, and it all comes off of his wall. Made the stop on the play. shaking their head. They can't believe that didn't go in. They thought they had extended the cushion to their lead, but unfortunately it hits the post and out. Moves into the slot. Here's a short pass to Shea. And that goes off a of body. And that's poked away by Drury. Handles the puck. Toronto's got possession of the puck. It's a two-on-one. Fantastic read to break up the play. On the attack into the offensive end, right up the gut. Takes the pass. Denies him. Samsonov's got it, and I think there's a little strategy involved as he opts for the whistle. So yeah, I think he needs a rest, but it's also about game management. Listen, the only reason why they're winning this game is because he has been electric and dynamic between the pipes. Tavares wins the draw inside his defensive zone. Passes on over to Bertuzzi. Here's a chance. Stones him with the blocker. Long jam in front. That's broken up. Bunting's looking pretty banged up out there, James. I'm not sure if he's going to finish the shift. Monster blocker stopped by Kachetov. The goaltender's at the last line of defense for a reason, and this time, he bails his team out. Moves it quickly over to Shea. Gains the zone from the right. Quick pass to Pesci. The lane was plugged up and that shot's 
blocked. Robertson's got the puck in his own zone. But this time of the game, you know the coach is in your ear. You gotta find a way to make a good puck decision. Get it in deep. Don't give up anything offensively. McCabe's taking it from his own end. Toronto's got the puck. The Leafs take it across the line. Takes control of the puck. Quick feed to Stahl. Break away! And Thutwood does it go! What a save! Well, the goalie makes a huge save at a critical point in the game before the shooter. You have to find a way to convert as you run down the stretch. Oh, what a save with a glove! Takes the feed at center from the right wing. Loses possession after he takes a little hit. Towards the gaping net. The Hurricanes really need a goal here. They've pulled the goalie and the extra attackers out. And the fans on their feet recognizing a solid victory here in front of them. And he hangs on just as time runs out. Yeah, they were cheating the best too, weren't they, James? And getting away with it. <laughs> it's all about knowing the details when you're at the dot. They executed perfectly. They ain't trying to be ain't cheating. This has really become one of the real premier party destinations in the hockey landscape, and here's a reason why. Look at the celebration here, Cheryl. And you got to love this. I mean, the fans are there for you while you're playing the game, and you come back here to say thank you to them. They're giving us the go-home cue, so we're going to get out of here. Thanks so much for joining, and we'll see you next time here on EA Sports.